Hello everyone, thanks for watching my video. Today is Saturday, March 9th, and it's a beautiful day in San Antonio. Currently it's about 82 degrees outside, nice and warm. And I brought a lot of my plants out of the greenhouse today because of that. So, I specifically wanted to cover my goji berry, which is right here. Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but I posted a video about two months ago when I purchased this plant from a nursery. And I decided to air layer a few of the branches on this goji berry to multiply them and propagate. Um, reason why I did air layering, the method I, I used was because even if it doesn't take, if no roots form underneath these air layers, then it's not a wasted plant all right all i have to do is take off the soil medium around the the wound and in time it'll heal up itself even though no roots had formed but i already cut one off today and roots were formed and i'm going to do the rest of these right now to show you the process and the results of the air layer uh, for the past couple months it's already flowering. I don't know if you can see that right here. But I know in summertime is when this plant uh, bears or the fruit starts to grow. So I got a head start and I kept it in the greenhouse during this cold season, winter season. And now I'm going to clip off the air layers and throw them in these cups with some soil. All right, aluminum foil is off, and I'm going to try to get you a good view of the root system on all three of them. All right, you see the roots on that one right here? It's on the back side, they're real small. So I'm going to hurry up and put these in these pots right here. And before I cut them off, I wanted to show you what the, the plant looks like before I cut them off. All right. Okay, here's the final product. This is my goji berry now with all the air layers cut off. And here they are in their cups. This is the longest one. I think I'm gonna trim this baby down. That's about three feet long on growth. The root system, I don't think they'll be able to handle that much on it. This middle one is looking really good size-wise and it has a couple flowers on it. Might take the flowers off and uh, allow the root system to get stronger on this one. And the same thing on this one. This is a nice size as well. A couple flowers on it. If you can see right there, not too bad. But I will chop it down, this one right here. And I just wanted to show that goji berries can be propagated by using air layering techniques. And with the right conditions, the roots will form. Versus, if you were to take cuttings, no doubt, they probably would uh, root under the right conditions. But it's not always 100% guaranteed that cuttings will root. So that's why I like the air layering method. Alrighty, well thanks for watching my video. And I'll give you guys an update in about a month or so.